today I have a 14 inch wreath frame that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. And I'm, I'm gonna be using five ribbons. You see four here and one is a buffalo check. And I'm gonna take one and measure out 10 yards. You're gonna need 10 yards of each and these are one and a half inches wide. And then I'm gonna start rolling them up together. Once I have my roll, I'm gonna get some um, zip ties and I'm gonna go around the crossbar for my first one. And holding all the ribbon together, I'm gonna to tie it down. And then I'm gonna take my four fingers and I'm gonna use it as my measuring for my first loop. I'm gonna be tying this down to the two rails in the center of the wreath with the zip ties. And you can push these forward a little bit if you need to. So I'm gonna measure with my four fingers, take my zip tie, go under the two rails and tie it down. Now in each section between each crossbar, I felt like I could get about six in there to make everything turn out correct. And you wanna to try to find the smaller zip ties for this. Yes, you can use pipe cleaners. I choose not to, but you most certainly can. Again, four fingers, tie down. Now when you get to the crossbar, I just made a loop over the crossbar and then continued. And you're gonna go all the way around the wreath with this exact same motion, same pattern. Now when you pick your ribbon, um, I just grabbed what I had. I knew it had long lengths. Um, it came out fine. Um, but you can pick any colors you want, whatever, whatever you're going to do. Just make sure there's 10 yards in a roll. Once I was done, I'm going to go back and I'm going to clip off all the zip ties the excess zip ties. And now I'm gonna start separating my ribbon. My first one, I'm gonna take the, the buffalo check, the black and white to the left, and then the next one, I'm gonna start spreading them out to the right. And you wanna alternate going all the way around the wreath. I'm gonna to go to the left. and then I'm gonna to go to the right. And you're gonna do this all the way around the wreath. And then when I get to this long tail that's left, you are gonna have plenty of ribbon left. I'm gonna wrap it up and I'm gonna zip tie it right there, and then I'm gonna flop that other part down. And I'm just gonna use the crossbar or the rails to attach my zip tie. And now I'm just gonna take my scissors and I'm gonna cut my loop and then cut the rest of the ribbon as even as possible. And you can do whatever you want with the ends. I just do an angle cut across all of them. I just love the way these wreaths come out. They're very full. So I found this bicycle at the Dollar General. It says, enjoy the ride. I grabbed it for $4 and it just matched my colors perfectly. And I just used a um, 
jute to tie at the top. I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chalkitupfancy.com. For any paint products, tissue paper transfers, or mesh stencils, chalkitupfancy.com.